Welcome to the introduction of the new DAS202 DVB-S2 signal analyzer from LabGear. Um, one of the functions of the uh, of the DAS202 is this very unique satellite detection function and um, I'm going to show you how it works. Now obviously if you uh, if you do a lot of work on one particular satellite then you may need you may not need this function it can skip to the next next tool which is your, your digital alignment or spectrum tool but uh, if you're working on a different platform or in a different location then this handy handy tool will help you find the satellite in the sky before you're even connected to the dish so let's start um, as you can see on the screen there's the arc and uh, to the right of screen we have LNB1 at 156 degrees east which is Optus C1D3 now that's selectable from the menu um, you'll also see a, a round circle on that arc which represents that particular satellite in the inside the arc you'll see a flashing square the flashing square is represents our position and if I move the instrument left and right you'll see the azimuth at the bottom of the screen change and if I move the instrument up and down you'll see the elevation change as well now the aim of the game here is to get that little square inside that round circle so first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to get my azimuth correct so I'm going to pan the instrument across to here come back to the west a bit and then raise the elevation I need to go back to the east raise the elevation until the little flashing square is inside the circle now looking at the bottom of the screen we've got our azimuth and the elevation at 45 degrees and we're in Melbourne so the front of the instrument is now pointing directly at Optus C1D3 so now all I need to do now is look down, look through the instrument and I'm looking straight at the satellite. Now just as another example, on the left of the screen at 105, sorry 100.5 degrees east is um, AsiaSat 5. So if I wanted to line up AsiaSat 5 all I need to do now is I need to lower the instrument because it's lower in the sky and then pan the instrument across to the west Keep going along, lower, lower, up a bit. Okay, and into the square. Now the front of the instrument is now pointing directly at Asia Sat 5 at 105 degrees east. Oops, a little bit to the to the west. And the elevation is 26 degrees. So there you have it, the uh, unique auto satellite detection function in the DAS202 DVB-S2 signal analyzer from LabGear. Thank you.